So somewhere around 85% of the flour in the UK is made with wheat grown within our shores. And the other part is 15% is imported, and most of it comes from Canada or Germany, a little bit from France and America. But it's important for us to have our own resource. And when there is a bad harvest, then yes, we have to go abroad. Fundamentally, we go to either Germany or France. Um, but likewise, when they have a bad harvest, they have to hunt round. But this is keeping British agriculture going, uh, but it's also key for us to have a supply that is on our doorstep and we can call upon it any time we want. We need UK wheat, essentially. We need the farmer. Uh, we need the security of, of homegrown wheat. Um, we obviously can import. The UK is, is, a, is a wealthy country. We can import grain and we need to import some grain, but that's only for specific flours. So specific processes, if you need something particularly high in protein, so like pizza flour, we'll need to import foreign wheat because we don't grow anything that high in the UK yet, but we're looking to try and do that. Um, so yeah, UK wheat is, is, is enormous. You know, a lot of our customers want 100% UK, so we do need to source from the UK, and we try to work with farmers as much as we possibly can. UK agriculture creates the patchwork landscape that we treasure and it allows me as a farmer to look after the environment. If I can't produce food I, I can't make money and I can't look after the environment and that's something that I am absolutely passionate about and committed to. You know on this farm we have yellow hammers, we have kingfishers, we have otters, we have barn owls, we have swans. It's beautiful and it really really matters that there's a productive element there to support all of that biodiversity and nature. And as a grower of food, it matters to me that we can all be secure that there is food in our supermarkets and that when our families are hungry, we can feed them. 85% of, of wheat for flour being produced in the UK is absolutely phenomenal. And whilst that imported flour is required, and that is all part of a, a secure food system, you know, we, we need a degree of import and a, and a degree of home production. That home production is the canvas for so much more than, than food. It's interesting, every year is different. As we mentioned, the variability in, in crops, in, in climate, in economies, it's changing all the time, so no year is the same. Um, it makes it very challenging. So, you know, we have to create a perfect product from an imperfect world or imperfect material, raw materials coming through, which is, which is what we're doing. So it is, it, is, it is difficult, it's challenging, but it's really rewarding. Yeah.